Hi you guys and welcome to my channel. Finally you guys. Finally I have a camera that works. I am so excited that I now have a YouTube channel and um, a lot of you guys that follow me on Instagram want me to make videos and now I finally can. And I figured my most requested look was on this makeup that I'm wearing right now. A lot of you guys called it mermaid makeup, so I guess that's what I'm gonna name it. Sorry about the lighting down here. I'm in my boyfriend's apartment and I gotta do with what I have, so <laughs> I hope that you guys can learn something from me. I am by no means a makeup artist. I mean, I wanna be, but I just have a passion for makeup and I wanna share with you guys my passion. If you guys that follow me on Instagram, um, want me to make 15 second videos and it's really hard with the looks that I do to make 15 second videos so why not make videos for you guys if you guys would like to see how I created this look then please keep watching so starting out with tape on my eyes and nothing else on my face when you do eyeshadow especially with high pigments like I'm going to be using you get a lot of fallout and if you have foundation on your face it makes your cheeks like a whole big freaking colorful rainbow so by using tape it makes it a sharp line and it's easier to create a more sharp classy look I don't know if you can make these colors look classy but we'll try okay so first off what I'm going to be doing prepping my eyes primer is the most important thing in this entire universe if you haven't used primer I I don't know what you're doing with your life, girl. This is the primer that I am going to be using. I'm using a white eyeshadow primer. You can use a white eyeliner. It does the same thing. I like it because it's sparkly. So what you're going to be doing is just applying that all over your eyeballs. In a mirror, sorry, you guys. I don't have a fancy setup yet, so, you know, got to do with what I have. This is my favorite palette ever. I really wish that I can use these colors in all of my eyeshadow looks, but First off, going in with a transition shade is super important because it's very easy to make... Oh, sorry. If you see me looking over here, it's because I'm looking at my viewfinder and this is new for me, guys, so I don't know like whether to like look straight into the camera or... With a fluffy blending brush, I am using a MAC 224. I'm going in with Saddle by MAC. Going in and blending that into my crease. Sorry about this lighting. I wish I could do something better. I'm gonna do one eye at a time. Okay. Now, for the colors. Okay, going in with a brush that came with the electric palette, making the color Freak, which is this, applying a generous amount onto my brush, applying that on the inner corners. Okay, use the same brush. Going in with the Caligonzo, which is, and applying that on the outer corners. I don't have a specific way on the technique I use to put this eyeshadow on. I literally just tap it. The most important part of this look is blending. If you do not blend this eyeshadow, you're gonna look like a drag queen very fast. Going back in with your fluffy brush. Going in with the same brush. You can use any eyeliner brush. Going in with the same color Gonzo. Um, and kind of create a cat eye. And just reapply. Okay, now what I like to do is go in with this color right here it's called Chaos, which is my favorite color. Just work that on my. Oh my god! And you guessed it, blend it out. If you're like me and you are never completely happy with the way your makeup comes out, go back in with Freak. Okay, so what I just did is my highlight, my contour, and my eyebrows. If you would like to see how I do those, comment below. And I know in my picture on Instagram I did do eyeliner, but I'm not going to do eyeliner this time because I feel like you don't need eyeliner for this look. So these are the ones that I'm using. Mascara, I'm using L'Oreal Telescopic. You could just apply a coat.
So now it's time to go on with eyeliner. NYX's eyeliner in blue eyes. Okay, so I'm just going to be applying that on my waterline. We are going to be going back in with um, our Electra Palette Freak on the inner. And then go back with Gonzo. We're going to do the same exact and then just applying a coat of mascara. And just to top off this look, I'm going to be using a highlight, Max Soft and Gentle. I'm taking that on a fan brush and just gently. I'm lining my lips with YX's lip liner in Nude, I think it's called. I'm going in with another lipstick by them called Cirque. And then going over Cirque with their lipstick again in Strawberry Milk. Okay, you guys, so this is the finished look. Alright, you guys, that's it. I take all types of requests. I will do anything you guys want me to do. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like this video, and I will see you guys soon.